In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good afternoon, Christendom. Um, I'm standing in front of Chaley, but I'm not telling you anything that you don't know. Um, I thought what uh, we do for the next couple of videos is kind of wander around campus. Um, I'm not sure if it's to get you to miss it, to want to be here, or so you can have some joy that you don't have to deal with everything. I don't know where you are in the list. But uh, just to reiterate what I had said uh, before, um, it's really weird that the campus is empty and that you're not here. I miss you guys. Um, the faculty and the administration, faculty and the staff, we all miss you too. Um, so standing in front of Chaley, um, the one thought that I think is that I want to share with you is that just as um, in order for the school to run, um, you need a good administration. So it's important to pray for uh, Dr. Donald and uh, Mr. Alina and everybody who works here. Um, we have to have our lives organized. Um, so when you think of Chaley, I, what I'd like you to think of is uh, the level of organization that you make an effort to have in your life and also um, in your family, uh, the need to have things organized. Um, it's easy for things to get chaotic and to get out of control. Um, it's hard to keep things in order. Um, it's worth fighting against that so that things are where they belong and things happen in the order they're supposed to happen. Um, the more we have that, generally the more peace we have, and the more peace we have, the easier it is to do God's will, and I think, frankly, there's more joy. So, um, if you reflect on Chelly at all, please pray for everyone who's here, um, and also take a moment to just think, is there order in my life the way I need to have order? And if there isn't, um, specifically ask your guardian angel to help you with that, so that in your personal space, in your study space, and also um, in the home that you're in, um, that we're a cause of order and peace so that we can bring the life and joy God wants us to bring into our home. I'll talk to you later.